Imagine waking up in the early hours of the morning to see this. Firefighters tackling flames and smoke at a hostel in New Zealand's capital city. Details about the incident are still emerging, but city officials moved quickly to help. It's a strange situation to be in um, as the mayor. I, I've, um, I'm feeling a lot of pain and emotion for those who have been lost. And um, <clears throat> at, at this moment, we just have to get um, those who have made it out of the building, getting them feel safe. The Loafers Lodge has 92 rooms, and while most guests have been accounted for, a number are still missing. Survivors grateful to have made it out alive. Scary, you know, being, you know, first time I've been in a house fire, especially on the third floor, because, you know, you're thinking, f am I going to get down? But, you know, I made it out safely. Firefighters described a confusing and chaotic scene. When you're woken from your sleep with alarms going, smoke, um, people would have been pretty emotive trying to escape. For the crew, crews, it would have been pretty horrific. Uh, flames coming out of a building with people inside is, is our worst nightmare. Investigations are underway as New Zealand faces the aftermath of this terrible fire. There will be a thorough review of this, as there is in these sorts of situations. That will be an opportunity to test whether or not um, you know, this building was fully compliant with all of the rules that it needed to be compliant with. As the facts are established, what is clear is that the damage and the loss is devastating. Subba Chowdhury, Sky News.